Alright, I know I've shown this before, but the uh, this new basic Jewel Thief um, with these 4.7 millihenry inductors and no, uh, it's got no uh, LED. They'll pump out, uh, it looks like about 13. The 100 millihenries are even higher. I'm going to have to uh, reset this thing. Give me a second. This is the uh, inductors right there. Alright, so I've reset the uh, peak here and it's showing 18.4 volts. And uh, peak to peak. Hold on. There we go. Do a quick freeze. Pretty steady uh, frequency. I've checked that frequency. I reset the uh, frequency markers and it's showing 230 US. That's uh, looks like 4.27 kilocycles. Um, I'll, I'll ch check this battery and see what we, we're working with here. It's not much. This battery doesn't have that much power. It's a crystal battery. So under load we're right at half a volt and half a volt with this very simple circuit and 200 millihenry uh, inductors Th these are here just for the uh, I'm just using the inside of these to connect the uh, the oscilloscope but anyway <laughs> we've got 500 500 millivolts under load producing 18.4 volts uh, peak to peak with a nice uh, nice pulse DC signal that we can use to uh, charge batteries. I'll see if I can, uh, maybe in another video, I'll see if I can pop a couple of, uh, <laughs> see if I can pop a couple of uh, double eight rechargeables, see if I can make them explode, or maybe charge them really quickly, who knows. We'll see.